Hey everyone, I'm Mr. Willis, and this is your Macro Minute on Secrets of the Phillips Curve. Movements along the Phillips Curve, shifting the entire Phillips Curve, can all be so confusing. Don't tell anyone, but there's an easy way to figuring it all out. Listen carefully, because I'm about to give you three secrets to the Phillips Curve. Secret number one. Movements along the short-run Phillips Curve are caused only by changes in aggregate demand. And the movement along the Phillips Curve will be in the opposite direction of the shift of the aggregate demand curve. For example, when a change occurs in Sig X that causes aggregate demand to increase, the aggregate demand curve will shift to the right. To show the increase in the inflation rate and the decrease in the unemployment rate that accompanies the increase in aggregate demand, there will be a movement leftward along the short-run Phillips curve from one point to another. Rightward shift of the aggregate demand curve, movement leftward along the Phillips curve. When a change occurs in Sig X that causes aggregate demand to decrease, the aggregate demand curve will shift to the left. To show the decrease in the inflation rate and the increase in the unemployment rate that accompanies the decrease in aggregate demand, there will be a movement rightward along the short-run Phillips curve from one point to another. Leftward shift of the aggregate demand curve, movement rightward along the Phillips curve. Secret number two. Shifts of the short-run Phillips curve are caused only by changes in short-run aggregate supply, and the shift of the Phillips curve will be in the opposite direction of the shift of the short-run aggregate supply curve. For example, when a change occurs in RAP that causes short-run aggregate supply to increase, the short-run aggregate supply curve will shift to the right. To show the decrease in the inflation rate and the decrease in the unemployment rate that accompanies an increase in short-run aggregate supply, the short-run Phillips curve will shift to the left. Rightward shift of the short-run aggregate supply curve, leftward shift of the Phillips curve. When a change occurs in RAP that causes short-run aggregate supply to decrease, the short-run aggregate supply curve will shift to the left. To show the increase in the inflation rate and the increase in the unemployment rate that accompanies a decrease in short-run aggregate supply, the short-run Phillips curve will shift to the right. Leftward shift of the short-run aggregate supply curve, rightward shift of the Phillips curve. Secret number three. You can identify inflationary and recessionary gaps on the combined graph for the short-run and long-run Phillips curves. The long-run Phillips curve represents the economy's natural rate of unemployment. So, if an economy is experiencing a recessionary gap, it can be visualized by a point along the short-run Phillips curve to the right of the long-run Phillips curve. If an economy is experiencing an inflationary gap, it can be visualized by a point along the short-run Phillips curve to the left of the long-run Phillips curve. Thank you so much for watching. Those are the secrets of the Phillips Curve, and this has been your Macro Minute.